Welcome to Assassin's Creed 2. I am starting a new game. I've already sort of set up my settings. I'm gonna try to play with mouse and keyboard again, as I did with Assassin's Creed 1. I'm gonna create a new game. I'm gonna play as Desmond. And let's begin. My name is Desmond Miles. I'm a prisoner of war. A war I never knew existed. Waged by two groups I never thought were real. Templars and assassins. The Animus showed me the truth. The things I've seen, the things I've been. A thousand years of history flowing through my veins, brought to life by this machine. They're using it. Using me to search for something. Call it the Apple. It's an artifact. One of many so-called pieces of Eden. Templars collect them. It's how they stay in power. And if the Templars get their hands on another one, everything will change. They want to make us all their slaves. When they first brought me here, I was afraid of what would happen if I tried to fight back. Now? Now I'm afraid of what will happen if I don't. But I can't do it alone. And maybe I don't have to. I met someone. Her name is Lucy. I think she's on my side. And she's gone now. She's taken away by that bastard Warren Vidic and his Templar masters. I don't know what will happen to her, or what'll happen to me. All I know is I need to get out of here. And I need to do it soon. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story. Wow. We're picking up right where we left off. Press any button. Okay. We have to go. Lucy, where have you been? Why did they- Now. Desmond, what happened to your face? Okay, why can't I move? I can't move. Did I not select mouse and keyboard? Oh, it's back on controller for some reason. Okay, let's select that. Selecting. Am I not allowed to select it? What? We're off to a great start here. Ah, there we go. Hey, I want to look around at my room again. There's the thing on the wall, just like we left it. Get over here, Desmond. I want to look around first. Oh, I can't go in the bathroom. I'm going to have to adjust my control sensitivity. Okay, I'm here, I'm here. What's up? Get in. What's with the blood? Are you okay? Look, we have maybe 10 minutes, maybe, before they figure out what I've done. If we're not out of here and on the road before then. Wait, we're leaving? Desmond, I promise I'll answer all of your questions later. But right now, I need you to just shut up and do what I say. So please get in the animus. All right. Lucy, you. Hurry up, Desmond. We're running out of time. You look very different, Lucy. But I want to look around first. I want to see what if anything's doing, different. Desmond, lie down. I want to see if anything bad will happen if I if I wait too long. Here's the laptop. Around. Get in the animus. Okay, okay. You look like you've changed your clothes entirely, Lucy. Lie down. Looks like your hair has grown. <laughs> it's changed colors. My face has changed since the last game. Lie down. All right, all right, I'll lie down now. Are we going to do a tutorial again? Subject 17, Desmond Miles. Whatever happened to Leela? Subject 16, Confidential. Maybe that's Leela. Searching for relevant memory data. Memory match found. 
accessing memory. Spingi! Spingi! Di nuovo! Sì, sì, brava! It is a boy! Oh, my love! Mi dispiace, I, I was at the bank when they told me. Did I miss it? Am I too late? Give him here. Giovanni! Shh, my love. It will be all right. Tu sei un auditore. Sei un combattente. Perciò, combatti. Oh, I gotta do this. Uh, uh, that's that button. That's that button. Listen to him. A fine set of lungs. And what shall we call him, my love? Ezio. Ezio Auditore da Firenze. What? That's it? We're leaving the Animus already? Get up. Let's go. Yeah, well, I'm gonna need a second. There isn't time, Desmond. We have to leave. What was that for? Just so we get Ezio's name? Get his data somehow? Oh, okay, I'm holding down shift. I changed a couple of keys from the first game, so... Oh, really getting out of here, huh? Sturgo's got some fucked up interior decorators. Stay close. Hey! You're not supposed to be up here! Open this door! I'm calling it in! We have a breach in the research wing. I repeat, there's been a breach in the research Follow wing. Follow me. That's Walt. Back up. Nancy. There they are! Don't let them get away! <laughs> oh, Lucy knows karate all of a sudden. Holy shit! I rigged them to loop old footage. How do you think I managed to hide all your nighttime snooping from Abstergo? You're good. So I've been told. But they're on to us now. We need to hurry. Okay. Careful. Hmm? We need to get to that elevator on the other side of the room. Follow my lead, but keep an eye out for security. I'd rather avoid a fight. Yikes. Are we gonna have to do some stealthy assassin stuff? Is that an animus? Deal with these assholes. Oh. Damn, Lucy. Is it animuses or animi? What do you think, Lucy? Lucy, what do they need with all of them? Desmond. You said we were supposed to avoid detection, but we ran right past somebody. Fuck. I thought this card would work. It must be on a separate system, and I don't have the code. Wait. Shit. Come on. How did you do that? I don't know. Let's go. I've got eagle sight. Just like my ancestors. What was that in the animus? Subject 16? Ezio, Audi, Audi something? I think we've been wrong all along. 
That's why we need to get out of here. Vidic and the Templars, they're only part of the problem. What do you mean? I'll explain when we get there. Get where? To the parking garage, of course. Um... I'm punching people this time. I'm button mashing until you guys are down. Okay, they're not really stopping. I'm trying to use stuff from the last game. Got one of them. Oh, damn! I'm trying to... Trying to... Block. Like I remember. Come on, Lucy, help me. <laughs> Man. Takes a lot of punches to get these guys down. Man, this the tone of this game really shifted. Get in. You're joking. It's for your own protection. Oh, man. We're almost there. I'm afraid to hit my mute key because I'm scared it's gonna like skip a cutscene or something. Thanks for that. It was great. Shoving the trunk, bouncing around. Loved this it. way. So, gonna tell me what's going on now? There was a reason for the escape, Desmond. Figures. We need your help. For what? Another treasure hunt through time? Abstergo's gonna replace their Apple of Eden. The map your ancestor found guarantees it. The other assassins, they'll do what they can, where they can, but... What? What is it? We're losing this war, Desmond. The Templars are too powerful. And every day, more of us die. I still don't see how I fit into things. We're going to train you. Turn you into one of us. What? No. No, you've seen me in action. I'm no good at this, and even if I was, it would take months. Years, even. No, not with the animus, not with the bleeding effect. But I'm just one guy. Sometimes, that's all you need. So that's why you found him. My ancestor. What was his name? Ezio? If you can follow in his footsteps, you'll learn everything he did, just like he did. Years of training, absorbed in a matter of days. You broke me out of Abstergo and brought me here just to make me an assassin? Look, there's more to it than that. But it'll have to wait. Trust me, okay? All right, I'm in. Tell me what you need. Really? You're sure? I thought you'd be happy about this. Sorry, I'm just a little surprised. I spent the whole ride over here figuring out how I was going to convince you to do this. Save it. After what those Templar bastards put me through, I'm ready, willing, and able. Thank you. <laughs> that was a weird hug. Why does Desmond have a scar on his lip? Lucy! You made it! God, it's been so long. Seven years. Can you believe it? Indeed. Welcome back. Ah, so this must be the infamous Subject 17. Desmond Miles, was it? Who are you? I'm sorry, where are my manners? I'm Sean Hastings. This is Rebecca Crane. Nice to meet you, Desmond. Right, well, it's been lovely chatting, but if you don't mind, Desmond, it's best we get straight to work. Time is precious. Doubly so these days. We've got everything set up and ready, Lucy. Just say the word and we'll get going. Here, I brought you something. A parting gift from Abstergo. Whoa! The memory core! This is amazing. With their data, things are gonna go a lot faster. I'll get to work on merging the code. I forgot about those two. What's your name? Rebecca? Hey, Desmond. What's up? Just wondering what your role is in all this. I take care of Baby. It's my job to keep her up and running. Baby? You mean the Animus? Actually, I prefer Animus 2.0, since Baby's twice as awesome as anything you'll find at Abstergo. The Templars might have deeper pockets than us, but they've got no ambition. 
No passion. No competitive edge. That's why, even with all their resources, anything they can do, I can do better. Faster, too. Anyway, take a seat when you're ready, and we can get started. I just need to make a few more adjustments. It looks a lot more comfortable to sitting as well. Hey, listen. I just wanted to say thank you. And uh, I'm sorry. Sorry? Yeah, you know, before. Everything at Abstergo. It was just... I wasn't ready. It's okay. No. Going through all that. Knowing that the Templars still exist, what they're planning. What's done is done, Desmond. You're here now, and that's what matters. Lucy, I've been seeing things. Symbols in my bedroom. The code on the keypad. Just like Altair. It's from the bleeding effect. You're taking on more than your ancestors' memories. You're taking on their skills, too. In this case, Eagle Vision. Skills? You're more receptive now. So if all goes well, everything Ezio learns in the Animus, you'll learn too. You really think this will work? That I'll become an assassin? You already are an assassin. You'll just be better at it. Yeah, hopefully much better at it. I mean, seriously, I saw the tapes from Abstergo. You didn't even try and escape. What a dick. <laughs> yeah, I didn't actually press a button earlier. I just hit my mute key to unmute the microphone and it launched me into a cutscene. Sorry, Desmond. I've got some stuff to take care of. We can talk more later. Okay, so, so uh, now I know I can talk to them multiple times. Sorry, can't talk now. What about this guy over here? The Brit. What's all this stuff for? This stuff, Desmond. Oh, this stuff is nothing special, really, this stuff. It's just the stuff that keeps our entire operation from falling apart, really. It requires a great deal of concentration to keep it all moving, so you'll forgive me if I don't have time to play meet and greet. Sean's in charge of maintaining our knowledge archives. It's like a digital library. He'll be riding shotgun with me while you're in the Animus. So if you come across anything of note, people, places, events, etc., he'll create database entries you can consult for additional information. Yeah, it's not just databases, though. I also provide tactical support for the other assassins. You know, Desmond, the ones who are out there, actually doing stuff, risking their lives, little things like that. Hello, Desmond. Go away. <laughs> yeah, that was another unmute button press. So this is going to be a problem. Every time I hit my mute key, it's going to activate something. Well, it kind of looks like... Oh, there's an empty chair over here. Hmm, what does that mean? Can I sit here? Who's this computer station for? I wonder. Can I just walk around anywhere and look at stuff? I feel like they really... Oh, there's a chessboard here. Please, mate, bother someone else, okay? I've got stuff to do. Oh, I thought I was activating the chessboard. I feel like they really toned down the stuff you could do outside of the Animus in the second game. But apparently I can just run anywhere. Yeah, I can just run all over the warehouse. Is there anything down here? I feel like that's probably a waste of time, so I'll just go back. Anything over here? Elevators? A giant metal locked door. I bet we're gonna be going there later. Maybe. Looks like there's nothing to do but hit the old Animus 2.0. So how does this work? Of course. Deep breath. Ah! Oh, what are you, a tiny child? Sean! Well... Here we go. Loading screen. Action completed. Yay, I got a Uplay message. Oh, I can move around.
Republica Fiorentina, 1476. Is it still loading? Can I just click through this? That took a long time to load. Nice boots. Insieme per la vittoria! Insieme! Insieme! Silencio, my friends! Silencio! Grazie. Do you know what brings us here tonight? Honor. Viere de Pazzi slanders my family's name and forces his own miseries upon us. If we... Enough of your nonsense, Grullo! Buonasera, Viera. We were just talking about you. I'm surprised to see you here. I thought the Pazzi hired others to do their dirty work. It's your family that cries for guards when there's trouble, Cotardo. Afraid to handle things yourself? Your sister seemed quite satisfied with the handling I gave her earlier. <laughs> oh! Uccidetelo! Wait, was I supposed to do something there? Wait, did I stop that? Okay, I guess I'm supposed to fight Via de Pazzi's men. That was that was weird. Why why else would I be here but to fight these people? Oh, damn. Oh. Apparently, I just repeatedly press the left button. And these guys just go down like a ton of bricks. Oh, I have a deflect button as well. What was that? Deflect button? Oh. Hey! Behind you! I guess that's what it was. What are you doing here? I wanted to see if baby brother had finally learned how to fight. Oh. <sighs> And? <laughs> you have style. But endurance is what counts. Let's see how many of them you can ruin before they get the best of you. Oh, I'm sure it'll be... many, many. Who's next? I will just counter every one of these people. I don't have a throw button, apparently. I'll just kick him when he's down. <laughs> Man, there's like animations everywhere. <laughs> Hit me. Come on. <laughs> I'll just counter everybody and... Hey, don't throw rocks. That's not nice. Oh, I got two of them by mistake. <laughs> well, this is fun. I'm just beating everybody up. So far, it seems like the exact same controls as from the first game. Fall back! Fall back! Fall down. What? We want us one this. Your lip. Just a scratch. Let the doctor decide. It's not necessary. Besides, I've no money for this doctor of yours. <laughs> wasted it on women and wine, huh? I'd hardly call it wasted. Give me some floorings then. Or have you done the same? <laughs> <laughs> Search them. <laughs> There's bound to be something in their pockets. Loot the corpses. How do we do that? How do we how do we do that? Hold left button? What key is that? Right button? Oh, that button. I have that mapped to V. That's a terrible key. Why isn't... I feel like that should be Q. 
I normally use the Q key for interacting with things in games. Have I gotten enough yet? This is not very fun. So looting is new in Assassin's Creed 2. Apparently. It's a new thing. That should be enough. Let's get out of here before the guards arrive. What? Which? Where? What? Which way? This way? Your next available memory is always shown in your mini-map. Is it, though? Is it? I guess it is. I guess it's this. Hurry, Ezio! The sooner we're done with the doctor, the sooner we can sleep. You should see the other guy. Okay, I guess I will follow this guy to the doctor. It's our next mission. Running. Okay. Haha, uh -huh, I knocked my own brother off. <laughs> Are you gonna go? What did you do that for? <laughs> that was... Now where are you going? He just fell off the roof. <laughs> what is... My brother's not very good at this. Uh-oh, gotta go back down. Oh! I just remembered what key I was, I should have used for that. Hold on, hold on. I gotta, I gotta fix this really quick while I'm thinking about it. Options. Uh, whoa, God, this looks totally different from what it was before. Controls. Uh, customize. Uh, this should be B is what it's, that's what I did in the last game. So I want to make sure it's the same so I don't get completely and thoroughly confused. Ben trovato, doctor. Hmm, fratelli auditori, why am I not surprised? You've made quite a mess of yourself, young man. It's nothing, really. You must help him. That pretty face is his only asset. Fottiti. <laughs> there we are. Now get out of here. Grazie. This way. Doctors. Quite a night. Indeed. I only wish they were all as much fun. Oh, wait. They are. <laughs> uh -huh. We should head home, Ezio. Father sure to be wondering where we've gone. Yes. I'd rather avoid a lecture. Up for a little race, then? To where? Uh... Roof of that church. Sure. Sibling rivalry. Win the race against Federico. On the count of three. Uno. Where, where the hell are we going? Where? What? Baby brother still has much to learn. I don't know where the hell we're going. Come on, Tartaruga. I'm beating you. Come on, then. This way. Where are you going? You'll see. Are we going to the top of this place? Because we're assassins and that's what we do. We climb buildings and look around with our eagle vision. Whoops, I went the wrong way way. It is a good life we lead, brother. <sighs> the best. May it never change. And may it never change us. Ubisoft presents Assassin's Creed. 
two. I feel like that brother is not going to live very long. All right. Enough of that. We really should head home. Let's go. Wait. What? Ezio, let Christina sleep. There will be time enough for that later. Ah. Nightcap, pay a surprise visit to the beautiful Christina Vespucci. Ooh la la. I'm guessing that we are supposed to, uh... First we will look around and synchronize the map. Map updated. So it's Vieri. I'd better hide. Keep looking! He couldn't have gotten far! I'm hiding. Social status icons identify the level of danger and position of enemies. Hide from enemies in haystacks, wells, and rooftop hutches. Where am I trying to get to exactly? I, I don't know where I'm trying to go to. There's the doctor. There's a tailor, an art merchant. I literally have no idea where I'm supposed to be going right now. Whoops, I did not mean to do that. Oh, now I know where to go, because it just told me where to go, all of a sudden. Oh, arrows, arrows. Christina, Christina! Who's there? Me. Oh, it's you. I should have known. May I come in? Fine, but only for a minute. A minute is all I need. Indeed. W well, wait, uh, that came out wrong. Oh, oh. Come here. Oh, oh it's you. Hey, I was, I didn't know I was going to have to press stuff in the cutscene. I don't, <laughs> I don't know which button that is. Damn it. <laughs> press the head button. Why don't they tell me the key? I don't want to see the head icon. I want to see the key I'm supposed to hit. Christina! Christina! There you are. Your tutor will be here soon. Come, my daughter. Is it really so terrible that... Figlio d'un cane! What is this? Perdonate, messere! Chiedo venia! I'll kill you! No, no. That's not necessary. Guards! Guards! Voglio la sua testa! Ora! There's really no need for violence. Oh. Well, I think I should run away. Running. Running. You have me confused with someone else. I'm doing a tutorial. Some help. Oops. Oh. Okay. Okay. I'm trying to. Okay. Let me out of here. I just kind of want to run away. I don't really want to fight you guys. Okay. Unlock. No. Don't go in there. Ah. Oh, here's a ladder. There's a ladder. I'm going to go up the ladder. Do we have rooftop hiding places here? Uh, oh, there's a thing I can collect there, I saw. Did I, did I do it? Race is unlocked. Nightcap. Synced. Doctors now available for healing. Races unlocked. Press what? 
Press what button is that? I have no idea what button that is I'm supposed to press. Escape successful, you are now anonymous. When losing sight of you, guards will investigate your last known position indicated by a yellow circle on the map. So, where do I go now for my next story thing? Right there, I assume. Nope, nope. Wow, I don't like the way this works. The mini-map works differently. There's a, there's something there I can collect. I see blinking over there. But I'm not really worried about that. I'm just, I'm just here to power through the story as quickly as humanly possible. Hey, it's Palazzo Auditore. Completed in 1473, the Palazzo Auditore is notable for its rusticated stonework and Roman pilasters. Giovanni Auditore designed the palazzo himself based on initial sketches by Leon Battista Alberti. Once built, the palazzo became a fixture of the Santa Maria Novella district. Lorenzo de' Medici mentioned in a letter addressed to Giovanni. Jeez, how long does this go on? Dated 1474 that he admired the facade's lack of ostentation. Okay, yeah, well, this is new for the, the new game. I don't remember any of these in the original Assassin's Creed. Or maybe, I think, I feel like that sort of information was available in Assassin's Creed 1 somewhere, but it was really hidden. I feel like, I feel like in Assassin's Creed 2, they, they brought it out a lot more. They made it, whoops, I just fell all the way to the ground. Didn't really mean to do that, but it's fine. Oh, let's go see what this is. What are these things? Do I just run over them? No, I have to actually pick them up. Oh, it's money. I've looted money from my family home. Oh, hey. Hey, Dad. Giovanni Auditore. Let's talk. Good morning, Father. Come with me. Is something wrong? Do you think me blind and deaf, son? I know all about your fight with Vieri di Pazzi last night. And then this little visit to Cristina. Your behavior is unacceptable. It... It... It reminds me of myself when I was your age. I assume these misadventures won't interfere with your work today. No, padre. Avete la mia parola. I've prepared some documents here for Lorenzo di Medici to review. I need them delivered to him. With haste, Father. Return to me when it's done. Paperboy delivered Giovanni's letter to Lorenzo de Medici. Okay. I shall deliver the letter. Can I still access the database? Al magnifico Lorenzo di Medici, mio protettore e amico. I have done as requested and completed my investigation into the Milano incident. I can confirm for you that it extends far beyond the satisfaction with Duca Galeazzo Sforza's rule. It is my belief that other parties desirous of far greater gains manipulated events in such a way as to achieve their goals without being revealed themselves. Lampugnani, Olgiati, and Visconti are guilty of the crime, to be sure. And they have met fitting ends for their betrayal. But several other noble families are implicated as well, our own Francesco di Pazzi among them. Their cause and motive is not yet clear to me, but initial findings indicate a plan, the scope of which is sure to disturb you. Best we continue this conversation in person, as I am hesitant to put my suspicion to paper. Reply with a place and time, and I will meet you there. I have also ordered Francesco be held by the Gonfaloniere until we can clear up this matter. Yours in confidence, Giovanni. 
Well, that was pretty cool. Not often that games read things to you. Okay, so I need to deliver a letter. Sounds simple enough. And I go up to the rooftops to do this. It's definitely made some changes to the graphical engine. And uh, I would say not for the better either. Feels like it has a little bit more of a, almost a cell shaded sort of a look. As opposed to the first game, which was, was purely a realistic look. down there from here. going, right? Is it? Back. I don't know. Whoa, whoa, guards, guards, guards. Excuse me. The heralds. If a herald tries to draw attention to your assassinations, I bet you can bribe him to be quiet. Oh, that's from Rebecca. How and where am I supposed to go? Should I have gone inside? I feel like I should have stayed on the roof here and dropped in from above somehow. Except I don't really see... Oh, there's where I'm supposed to go. Sheesh. Man, the mouse sensitivity is really weird. Sometimes it's really slow, and sometimes it's really fast. I see now. I'm here. Ah, Ezio. Ben trovato. How are you? Come sempre. I have a letter for Messer Lorenzo. I'll see that he receives it when he returns. Returns? They've gone to Villa Careggi, I'm afraid. And not expected back for at least another day. I'll let my father know. Oh, I have to go back now? Okay. I thought it was over. I thought I was going to be about ready to finish up this first episode of Assassin's Creed 2, but apparently there is more to be done. Uh, why am I stuck here on that spot? I'll just, I'll just keep constantly coming in from the rooftop. Ooh, that was close. Come on, go down. Hello. Keep up the good work, Biscero. <laughs> you uh. worry too much, Giovanni. Francesco Di Pazzi is in prison. The threat is ended. Who said that? Which what freaking key is that? There we go. Ah, hello, son. 
You remember my friend, Hubert? Good morning, Gonfaloniere Alberti. To you as well, young man. I trust you delivered the message. Si, padre. But it seems Lorenzo is out of town. Hmm. I did not anticipate this. What does it matter? So you wait another day or two. Listen, your mother and sister have been looking for you. I'll need you again in a little while, but for now, see if you can't help them. Are you sure? Yes, now if you'll excuse us. Good to see you, Ezio. Paperboy synced. Oh, wow, we got a whole bunch of... Uh... Courier something unlocked. Courier assignments unlocked. They are now available. Open world tasks. Press the tab key to access the map. Yes, I know. Use the map to locate objectives and side quests. You can also set your own GPS marker in the Animus Desktop's map folder. So how do I know which one of these markers is a main quest and which is a side quest because I see there are three of them right here in this very room. How do I know which is which? Mm, I don't know. Well in any case I'm going to stop here and I'm going to assume that the game will remember this is where I want to pick up next time. I feel like this saving and loading is much much better in this game than it was in the previous game. What happens if I hit quit? Does it take me back to the menu? I feel like it's going to take me back to the main menu. Yes! And yeah, there's no exiting the Animus in this game, I don't think. I think it only lets you out of the Animus when it's a story time to get out of the Animus. Alright, well that's going to do it for the first episode. See you later.